So you're our next foe. What? Don't hear you tonight. Uh, you trying to start trouble? Take that, Katsune! And that! And that! And one of these! Uh, 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 hey, pump the brakes for a second. I don't think this guy's an enemy. I should warn you in advance. I'm not some naive Japanese tourist, so you had better not try anything funny, got it? I expect this car to head straight to my hotel. Certo. You want me to go straight to your hotel. Sounds good, though your bags will be empty on arrival. What the? He left? Why would he take off before I could get in? Hey, pretend you didn't see. Shit! No, no, no! <laughs> All right, now to find a taxi stand. Damn, look at him go! I know, I can't think of anyone who can futz with their ear like that. It's one hell of a crazy trick. <gasps> How is he even doing that? Gross! That's foul. How'd this guy fold in his entire ear? Wow. Gotta say, kid, that just made my whole day. How about some lunch? Thanks for the offer, but I'll pass. Huh? With me. I promise you won't regret it. I'll pay for it. How about no? Can I come? Now all of you just go away and leave me be. Okay. Adamani Giorno. <laughs> Ciao now. It's the guy from before! What a surprise. That's the distinct tang of a liar. <laughs> Mission doesn't involve joining our syndicate. It's absurd. Do you have any idea what you're saying? What isn't something it like beautiful? that would entail? It's injured, isn't it? Your left arm. <laughs> what? I thought that was a bed. In there. The thing I want to know is how the hell the guards even managed to fit in through the door. <laughs> is that all you brought to impress me? Well, besides that, I have this other little trick I can do. I can fold my ear into my ear canal. Eat my arrow. That's too far, Bastardo. You've messed with the wrong guy. Hey, eyes on the road. I got it. So Lord has actually offed himself. I told you to watch the road. Free money, really. And the way I heard it, he hit five billion lira. Uh, are you shitting me? <laughs> if I picked up that kind of moolah, I'd go abroad with a bitch and babe on each arm. Get real. Bravo, I knew you could do it. You're practically halfway to solving it. I get it. Six times five is 30. Nice. Huh? Hey, what the hell is this supposed to be? What, that? It's a strawberry. I can see what kind of cake it is, dumbass. It's not like I confused the damn thing with a chocolate or cheesecake. That's not the problem here! There's four slices! They might as well have told us to die! <sighs> You're more than welcome not to eat it. <gasps> no way! I demand to eat tortali frogolet! Yeah, I figured it out! All done, Fugo, see? You're finished already? Let's have a look. What's this? <laughs> Did I get it right? <laughs> Beastly little punk shit! You think you can mess with me? Hey, Bucciarati. Hmm? Do me a favor and stay away from yacht number four, okay? We'll sink to our deaths. Relax. Give me a cold one. Why do I bother? You want a cola or a fizzy water? Cola? No, a fizzy water. I want to see all the little bubbles. Hmm? Right, did I make you suffer? Getting attacked doesn't feel so good, does it? Well, too bad, here's some more! Did you really think you were better than us? You limp dick I have to let Mista know! What? Guido Mista's outlook on life has always been summarized by the saying, Simple is best.
You should really have a doctor take a look at that. Yeah, yeah, I already know that. But I want you to give me a bit of first aid in the meantime. All right, take it easy. Wait, Fugo, you're not gonna... Ah! Hey! Have you lost your mind? Did that just happen? <laughs> I see. Then do me a favor. Could you please take off your jacket for just a minute? You want me to take off my jacket? But what for? Don't worry, just take it off. Trust me, I have no interest in seeing you devoid of clothing. You've made that clear. Huh? I'm out of handkerchiefs, so go buy me one. While you're at it, get more nylons and Givenchy blush number two. Oh, and those nylons better be the ones with the garter at the thigh. And grab a copy of Vogitalia. Mineral water would be nice, too. But it has to be from France. I'd rather keel over than drink that other stuff. When you're done ogling the scenery, get started on that list. Now repeat everything we just discussed, start to finish. Huh? Well, uh... I buy all the stuff on the list, then drive around and around in a field until... Ooh! That's the wrong answer! Quit screwing around and get serious! Now tell me what I said from the beginning! <laughs> You told me to drive around an empty lot so I don't get dizzy. <laughs> ah, what the hell is wrong with you? No, that's not what I... No. Please, miss, you gotta forgive Fugo. He didn't mean to come off as an over-eager horn dog. I know it seems like we hit the brakes so my man here could peek at those jaunty jiggle sacks, but I give you my word, that's not it! Uh, Blame his weakness in the face just of food! Shut up, would ya? I was bracing for impact, and you're making it sound like I was trying to cop a feel! There. It's too dangerous for you to leave. Listen, Mr. Bucciarati, I have a question for you. It's kind of dumb, but even so, I hope you'll be willing to answer it. What's the question? Why isn't there a bathroom in this stuffy place? And please don't say you're expecting me to wear a diaper. <laughs> of course I'm not. But you do make a good point. Thank goodness. I knew you were reasonable. This closet will be our bathroom. Have at it. Uh, have at it? I assumed you needed to use it. Night out. How is he still moving? What's wrong? Speak to me, baby head. Say something. Come on. Huh? That dirty turtle shit is all over my face. I don't deserve this kind of torture and humiliation, you hear? Remote tracking is great until Daddy's little death machine decides to go off the rails. Kill me? I'm sorry. I guess the tires are skidding a little bit. On a road as straight as this one? Jeez, who taught you to drive? Wait, do you even have a license? I'm 15, so no. Everyone knows the capital of France, but English speakers pronounce it Paris, while most say Paris the way it's supposed to be. But somehow Venice has replaced the real Venezia as the global standard. Like those stories, The Merchant of Venice and Death in Venice. Why? Call the damn book Death in Venezia! It's not that hard! Are we not good enough? Learn a little Italian, puttana, and call the thing what it's supposed to be! Giorno! There they are! Me stop! Uh, just stop huh? doing it so hard! At least my damn clothes on! It's too intense! Narancha? <laughs> Did you find them? Uh, why? Uh, no, but... Uh, there's something in my eyes! Giorno! Uh, it's so stop. hard to see in this early morning light! I'll keep after it, though! Not so rough, damn it! Together, would you? Get over here, Apakio! I've got a present for you! Check the bowl for the surprise inside! You've lost your mind! Is this a new kind of fetish or something? Eat it! Bitch meat! Selva! Your damn curiosity's about to get you killed! You're insane! <laughs> Wait. Hang on. Did you hear that just now? Uh, the phone rang. Hey! Answer the damn question! 
No way that busted up phone was ringing, so what gives? I... I don't know what you're even talking... Huh? <sighs> there it is again. Where is it? Huh? <laughs> Where is it? <laughs> <sighs> so you do have a working phone. You've been holding out on me, Mr. Driver. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> hey, you there! Huh? The hell do you get off answering my phone? Hey, come on! Get your ass off of there, you idiot! Leave me alone! I'm about to piss myself! Like oh, hell, you're gonna! Oh, let go already! Oh, oh, this ain't the crapper! Oh, oh, it's over here, you oh, shithead! Oh. I won't let you down, trust me. I live only to serve and defend you. Sorry for hogging the phone like that. <laughs> you can have it back now. Thanks a lot. <sighs> uh, can you hear me? Seko, did you capture their agonized mugs? You know how much I love the totally desperate contortions they make while fighting for their lives. Uh, oh. <sighs> Yo! Good boy, 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 <laughs> Greedy mutt. All right, three it is. Are you ready, boy? Because they're coming at you now. <laughs> oh, whoops, my bad. Good boy, 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 you're such a good boy, Sucko, yes, you are. You see him anywhere? You just said he was hurt, didn't you? Uh, did you hit your head? I mean... Huh? My dude, do you even hear yourself? Uh, 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 Yo, the hell are these? Uh, 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 dude, what's going on? How'd I grow a pair of chesticles? Holy crap, my dingling is gone! Where'd you go, little guy? I'm serious, this is an emergency! <laughs> oh. oh my god. Am I... did we? <laughs> what horrible curse is this? I look hideous! Damn! My armpits stink! Dear Lord, just kill me now! Oh, come on now, Trish. That's just rude. We got bigger things to worry about than the smell of my pits. Like the stand that attacked us. This doesn't look like the handiwork of Emperor Crimson. Which can only mean we've got another bad guy out there trying to mess with us. Damn it! Ah! You gotta be kidding me with this, right? Do you ever think to clean under your damn nails? And shave your knuckles, too! It's called basic hygiene! Look it up! Every part of me stinks! Couldn't I have switched with someone who showers? Why'd it have to be me stuff? Well, I don't know. Maybe it's because we happen to pass out right next to each other. That aside, you know words can hurt just as much as bullets sometimes. It can't be that bad. Hey! Whoa there! What exactly do you think you're doing with those fingers? <laughs> it's not what you think at all! I wasn't trying to cop a feel, I swear to God! It's just the elastic itchy, you know? Better kick those hands out of my panties! All right, sorry! If I catch you touching anything else, I'll bury you alive! Fine, jeez, I get it! I'm just saying these panties feel like a bunch of rubber bands racing to see who can split my ass in half first! And your bra's a real hugger, too! <laughs> Listen, Dick! You even think about getting anywhere near my skirt again, I'll kill you! Do you hear me? There will be nothing left of you! <laughs> no, Roger! <laughs> Serious. Just hear me out. Ah, oh, jeez. For the last time, Mista, no one gives a shit. No, listen, this is a good one, I promise you. Gentlemen, let me ask you all. 
Do you think human flesh would taste like crap? Or would it actually rock? You... <coughs> Could you maybe not ruin all our appetites? What the hell goes on in that messed up head of yours? That's it. Go sit at the dipshit table. Carnivores. You know, like the lions, the cats, and the vultures. You won't find those meat-eating critters on a restaurant menu for one obvious reason. You ready? <sighs> because those nastiest suckers freaking reek, that's why! They taste like duty! I mean, you get it, right? Cat flesh is super nasty. You with me so far? Newsflash, you weirdo. None of us knows what a cat tastes like, because we would never even think to eat one! Oh. Mista! What's the damn holdup? Need a shit? <laughs> Don't go leaving me behind now. Sorry I gave you all a fright. I hope you'll still take me with you. It's a long way for a lone turtle. <laughs> Whoa, what are you doing? Oh, crap, my bad. I was just thinking maybe you might have had a point. My pits, they actually do smell like ass. <laughs> Can't believe I'm just now learning about this. Maybe I should put on clone after all. What? <laughs> Look, I might have exaggerated a little bit earlier. Everything happens so fast. Right now, I don't think you smell that bad. In a super weird kind of way, it actually feels nostalgic. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Do you really mean that? Yeah. But your fingers are freakish. <laughs> <laughs> on a whole nother level.